heard you shout. I won't fall this way. Tell me that you are arguing with your father again. Hmm? Ask him why he is trying to prevent me from offering the sacrifice that would save this kingdom from impending doom. I don't know why. So, He's what is your father thing. talking about? Mother, is he not that Ezemo? Is he not that Ezemo or what you people call him? He's demanding that father will slaughter more animals for him. Hmm? So? I am doing whatever he recommends for the preservation of this kingdom, which incidentally is your own kingdom, because you will take off to me. So what is wrong with that? Why wouldn't you want us to save our kingdom? Why? And father, you think a mess lots of um, animals will prevent that? Mm -hmm. So what is it? I like a father. I love you. I love you.
Christ is. Oh. Well, I thought that was the answer. No, I thought you were a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of we are scared. You might pick a face before. No, you cannot say what you try. Eh? How much have I told you how I to see you, you people fighting here and there? Eh? Fight among yourselves. People have been friends from childhood. If there is any problem, you should solve it by yourselves. Eh? Please. And that's what you're named. Us? Yes, of course. Are you not my friend? Oh, I see. So it's because of what happened the other time that you, you think I'm staying angry with it? 
I am not. I'm forgiving you. Well, you're very excited. Yeah. It's okay now. There's a cheat. Let's forget about this. You guys are my friend. I hope no grudges against you. Yes, sorry. No, forget it. Okay? I am okay with you. I don't have a problem with you. You know what? You guys are right on time. Why don't you just go inside and eat breakfast? Yes, mommy's even inside. Everybody, my sisters. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> So that I am happy you're back with your friends. Honestly, you know that's why I love men. They don't bear grudges. Yeah, you know that. Sure. Yeah. Mommy, you know me. And I love my friends as my brothers. I don't have any grudges against them. They're yeah. like my brothers. Yeah. Mom, what about father? Mm, is he not hungry yet? Your father is in a meeting with the chiefs in his private chamber. I see. Mm. Um, in that case, okay now, your father should be there. Yes. I was told you left me this morning. You were told. That means you left me very, very early. Adeze, you guys don't know this, okay? No, you don't know him. But I will explain him to you. Okay, now he's one sort of, um, how will I put it? He's such a spoiled brat. When I mean a spoiled brat, in the sense he doesn't stay at a place. Okay, now doesn't even put his axe at a place. What he does is this. When, once he wakes up in the morning, he brushes his teeth. Not even take his bath. And you see this guy, he's such a bad boy. When I mean a bad, that word bad boy with his capital letter. Really? If you're saying he's a bad boy, that makes all of you the same thing. Thank you. Remember the saying that goes, birds of the same feather flock together. Come to think about it. Imagine my brother, Prince Ebeka, calling someone a bad boy. That's like a kettle calling for black. Please. Thank you very much, my princess. For that love for me. How can I start? Mommy, you don't have to sign the page. Hello, baby. Are you serious? Where exactly are you guys now? Wow. That's good. That means we should be expecting you. Yeah. You know what, baby? Baby. Please, please, drive carefully. You're very, very important to me, okay? Now I'll be with you. Hello? <laughs> Mom, hmm? the governor's daughter. Oh, your girlfriend. Yeah, I told you she'll be visiting this year with her friends. Yeah, to be on our way. I remember, I remember. Your sisters uh, will prepare something for them. Yes, of course, Mom. As a matter of fact, we're so excited. Susie's our friend too. Yeah. Apart from the fact that someone wants to have her all to himself. No, I didn't hear that. You see, did she say that? <laughs> she did. No, no, no. This is a very big accusation. I can't take it. You know what? I have to contact my lawyer. No, don't worry. No, no, no. 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 I Mommy, you know, I don't take shit no, like that from anybody. Mommy, I don't. No, 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 no. no. I can't. Your Highness, you mean the Ezemo demands for bigger sacrifice? Yes. Then there is something heavy. If that is what they meant, that means Ezemo must have seen something. And it is not something we handle with kid gloves. <laughs> uh, it must be something terrible because going by the nightmares I've had recently, uh, it's something terrible and uh, we just have to do something about it to avoid the calamity. If the gods demand sacrifice, we have nothing left on us. Let us offer it. We have no right to question their judgment. Mm, I am not really questioning the judgment of the gods. 
I'm only hoping sincerely that our sacrifice will be enough to appease them. That's, that's just my fear. So that we can permanently avert this calamity. Of course, it will appeal them. You see, because they have never fed us before. Um, if we remember, we will know that our new young festival is around in a matter of days. Excellent. Um, so we will do everything possible to see that we have a wonderful celebration. You are right, Ichirobi. I'm even worried that this news is coming to us now that we are looking forward to having a big celebration. I sincerely hope it will work. Mm, I think it will work. I am giving you the assurance that everything will be put in place before the celebration commences. On our own part, I'll say let's just do what we ought to do to appease the gods. Like our people say, Nkita sesito polio, ubora polio gunyana ndemu. I mean, her beautiful friend. That's nice. God <laughs> bless. What's that? God bless. What's, what's up with your friends? Lenica, did you see her father is now a governor? Yes, her father is now the governor of her state. Yes. Really? I swear to God. You know, he was he used to be in the House of Assembly member. Yeah, he used to be. So he contested for the governorship election last year. And uh, he won it, lacks his points. You understand? So, I still find it very difficult to believe that my girlfriend Susie is now the most. That's interesting. My guy! <laughs> I'm a lucky one. Nice 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 yeah. See, guys, why don't we go? Imagine how she's going to feel to know that I'm a person that went to the bush to hunt a bush meat for her. She's going to be excited. It's going to be a surprise. What do you guys think? We are cool with it. Are you cool with it? Yeah. You sure? Are you cool with it, okay? You sure you're cool with it? Okay, in that case, I have to go inside and dress to something kind. Oh, uh, Maka, see, help me tell Mom and Dad that I'm going to hunt for my friends. Hunting? Yeah. Why? I want to go and hunt a bushmeat for my girlfriend that is coming. So you tell Mom and Dad. Do you have a problem with it? Thank you. Deliver my message. Alright, guys, I'm coming, okay? Alright. <laughs> Whatever it is, multiply can get from bad or back to the east or in Okay, okay, but are we not close yet? You yeah, understand. Okay, yeah, it's just not in town. I'm just like, look, sit in here. My foot hurts, okay? I don't know. Oh, please, please, hush! Last time I checked, I don't remember pregnant to be honest, you could be. So I would not take that for now. It's okay, baby girl, don't be like that. I was only joking. Come on. She's going to get Just go, I'll be fast about that. Please, please, I'm go. tired, yeah.
What do you think she wants to go and buy? I don't know. I'm guessing she wants to get cigarettes. Cigarettes? She just smoke? <laughs> I thought she said she was giving up smoking. I mean... Uh, well, you would think so, but oh no, she has not given up the habit. People don't give up smoking that easily, sweetheart. And a friend over there is born addicted to that spot. Now, she hasn't quit last time I checked. If only she knows how much I hate smokers. I mean, especially ladies. I hate them. Okay, I'm down. Nobody's fighting here. She's our friend. When she comes back, we can pick her on that. Janet, hurry it up! Really? Are you guys that close? Wow, that's good. That's good. Okay. Just keep coming. Alright, sweetie. Wow. Guys, yeah. She said they will be here in an hour time. You know what? We need to go inside the thing because I really need to get a very big catch. Do you understand? So, why don't you tell her that you're going hunting for her? Is it? She is not necessary. She loves surprises. Please let me. Well, that's different words, there's a track. Okay? And please hurry up, please. Very good. Hold on, please. Just take your time, okay? I need to hurry up. Okay, whatever. Don't take your time like that, just... Okay. Very, very snappy. Thank you. Don't mind her. Take all your time. Oh, my God. 
Hunting to friends. And he's not back by this time. Look, why didn't you people stop him? Father, you know, but they now. Whenever he wants to do something, nobody can stop him. What about the governor's daughter? Is she here yet? I've not seen her either. 
What is going on? Can you tell me who wanted to go? Okay, that's I told you of the series of nightmares I've been having. You get what the SMO said the other time it was here, and yet you are not known. Your Majesty, see, I did not know 
where Rebecca left the house. You did not tell me. Eh? You just sneaked out of me. I beg you in the name of God, please forgive me. I was in the kitchen. I was cooking. I was because there's a little in me. Because forgive me. I can't understand this. Why are my son and his friends not back yet? They left this place since morning. Why are they not back? Your Highness, what are we supposed to call this? That Ada Forest is not dead or what? Your Highness, you have a good channel on me. I don't know if I need Certainly. I agree with you, Emily K. Honestly, I, 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 I don't, I, I, I can't understand this. <coughs> Greeting, Your Majesty. Greeting. I heard that my son went hunting with the prince earlier today. Are they back? Is he there? They are not back. That's what I was discussing with them many years before you came in. They are not back. Does that mean something happened to them? No, God forbid. Nothing will ever happen to them. Your Highness. But why not send the cats to go and serve? I think that's exactly what I'm going to do. Why you see? The price is back. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's okay. Don't worry. We'll go back. Just leave me alone. Just leave me alone. I don't even know why you like bothering yourself. Eh? Why are you bothering you trying to put tension on everybody? Okay, what is that? Please, please. Okay, what are we talking please about? Please give me a break here. You like pampering this boy. He just went out. You give me a break then. Okay, eh? so we are talking about our only brother. So he went out and he's coming back late. Why are you even working yourself? Oh. Hey. Hey, now to Hey, make sure I'm going. Make sure I'm going. I'm going to go now.
What good is the fun? Mm. And you can talk to us. Sorry. We are attacked by a monster. My friend, we are killed. Sorry. He just managed to escape. Did that involve my son? Eh? How am I supposed to believe that you did not lure my son to the forest and kill him? Eh? Even kill his friends just to cover your secret? You are talking to my son. Your son was one of his best friends. You couldn't have lured him to the forest to kill him, then come back to the crime. Yes, he does. Yes. Why don't we send our warriors? Because we can't be sitting down here, folding our arms, and watch without doing anything. Let's send our warriors after whatever it is. That's exactly what I am going to do. I will send the warriors to the forest. I... Mm. Um, I'm not saying since you since I came, I'm with you. I should be asking you that. Didn't she say she was coming to me? She called me the very right room, actually. Mm. Are you trying to say they, they're not here? Neither said Susan or her friend. Are you serious?
Calm down. Calm down. I'm not you. I don't hurt you, okay? But who are you and how do you end up here? Chuma, come here. Where do you think you are going? I am going to the palace to see the prince. He will tell me what happened to my son. I need my son this morning. And that's all I need. Will you come back here? No way. I will not come back. I won't. He will surely tell me what happened to my son. He will surely provide my son to me. All I need is nothing but my son. And that is all. Chuma! Chima! Mama, won't you listen to Papa? Baby, I've sent some people to bring back your car. Can they also bring back Grace and James? Baby, come on. Take it easy on yourself. What happened was nobody's fault. Okay? Remember I lost two of my friends. You saw Ogenna's mother there. She believes I killed her son. Why does she think you killed her son? I... I don't know. Maybe because... 
I just don't know. Don't know. You don't know. Jimmy. Yeah. yeah. It's it's something. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm not hungry. You have to eat something. You must have a smoke. Can I go in from call my dad? Susie, what are you saying, Susie? Yes, Susie. I do not talking about the Honorable Minister's daughter. No! That is absolutely unfathomable. What took you to that land in the first place? As far as I know, that is not your school, Susie. I see. Now listen to me and listen very well. I want you to come home. First thing tomorrow morning, I'll make sure you come home with the Honorable Minister's daughter. I repeat, make sure you come back with the Honorable Minister's daughter. Nonsense! Briska! Briska!
Monster cannot come in. How do you know the monster cannot come in? Let me see. Oh. Oh. Wait. Where did you get this? Get what? How did you get this? This right here? Baby. Your Highness, Nietzsche, I have strong confidence in our warriors. So no matter what that thing is, they are going to defeat it and come back here victorious. Sure, there's no doubt about that. But the part I don't understand is there's a more saying he has no idea of what that thing is. Is that that the gods are unaware of what that thing is? You must see! You must see! You must see! The prince! It's the prince! It's the prince! He knows something about the monster! I think he has something to do with it! What was that? That was mysterious. Very mysterious. I've never seen Scout in all my life. They suddenly turn into night. I think we are dealing with a strange spirit here. And it is not something we fight with ordinary weapon. Commander, in fact, I'm getting scared. I'm getting scared. You just go back. No! Be courageous, my brothers. We are the great warriors of Iswala. We have to be brave. That thing cannot scare us. We will confront it. How do we confront it, Commander? By breaking the chains of God. <laughs>
about this monster. Baby, are you? Who do you think you're doing? You don't trust me. I just suspect. I saw you holding on to this drawing when I barged into your room. How did you get it? How did it end up with you? I don't know anything. And what, I, what exactly are you driving at? Tell me. No, 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 no. Go ahead and answer her. How did it end up with you? You know I'm seriously suspecting you. How come that you are the only survivor? Amongst the three of you in, uh, in the forest attack, if you have no connection with the monsters, and you think your girlfriend may not be suspecting you, then make a father. If there is something you know that we don't know, tell us now. What do you know about this monster? Father, I don't know anything. I swear to you. I don't know anything. Just, it was a python. 
are you trying to make us understand that there are two creatures haunting that forest, a monster and a python? Exactly, Your Majesty. Snacks, Comstock. How come this one is different? You see, that's what I've been saying. You should have been there to observe what we went through. Determined. Elders, this one is different. Transforms into all sorts of things. And maybe your majesty it also has a female voice. What? A female voice? Yes. I think I'm getting more confused. Are they female voice? What exactly are we talking about here? Help me if you can. Another female voice. As I'm aware, what was it you were saying outside? That I had something to do with what? <sighs> you were a podalo mel of water. You were want to, to reflect on your past. Try and remember what transpired between you and the Kemma Iroka of Umwada clan. The Kemma Iroka of Umwada clan. I don't know what you're talking about. Great one. Are you talking about a Kemma, my sister, who disappeared mysteriously many years ago? Jinka. I am talking about your sister. Igwe has something to tell us concerning your sister's mysterious disappearance. Does she have anything to do with this? Igwe, Igwe Malaysia, Akazu dia. Igwe try and reflect on your past. Tell us what happened to her. Alright. I was in love with her. And the relationship lasted even quite some time. And then she became pregnant. And my father said, Just listen to me. Just listen. You have to stop crying. It's not saying something that happened to you. Okay? Just stop crying. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> My prince, I'm pregnant for you and we're not even married. Emma, <laughs> just listen to me. I understand. But that is not enough for you to cry. The fact is, I am not denying the pregnancy. I will stand for it. <laughs>
I love the camera. And I'm, and I'm, I'm oh, what? Uh, I hope you are not trying to tell me that you will marry that is the woman instead of the woman that was betrayed to you. Instead of Ugoma. Eh? Let me tell you, that will never happen in this case. Never happen. Unless you are not ready to take by the truth. Hey, Father! Of course, I want to be the next king, Father. I want to take over from you when you're gone. In that case, you have to get rid of that pregnancy and make sure that nobody cares about it. Get that pregnancy terminated. What is the problem, Father? What problem is that? The came that I know will never terminate her pregnancy. She would rather die than to do a thing like that. In that case, My prince, what have I done? What have I done wrong? You've done everything wrong by thinking that you can entrap my son with pregnancy. My son has been betrothed the woman who is going to be the next queen of this kingdom. My original plan is to kill you. What? <laughs> but my kind hearted son pleaded for your life. We spare your life and kill the baby after they have been delivered. No. That is why you stay here until you are delivered of the baby. I will keep it a secret from everybody out there. Nobody should hear about it. It's only after you are delivered that we are free to go, but not until you have taken an oath in the fact to reveal it. What? My king! Are you saying that I'm going to be here until I deliver? You should thank my son for keeping your life. No. Yes. No, my friends. No. My friends, please. Take out. My prince, please, don't let him do this to me. Your majesty, please. My prince, what is my sister in Kemma? I don't know. She could not be seen since last night that she went to market. You know she's your friend, please. Have you seen her? I have not seen Kemma for the past three days. <sighs> She just hold it. Does that mean that she's missing? That's what it seems.
Father turned his back on Ezemai of Feda River because we lost the battle to Obinese Kingdom 40 years ago. He vowed never to worship Ezemai of Feda River and you followed his footstep. Now, it will. Ezemai and the baby are out to destroy our kingdom. According to our warriors, there were two monsters hunting the evil forest. Who is the other one? Could it be the other one? The other one is not the other one. The other one is the man who will kill. 
killed to sell his secret. The evil spirit of Ender Forest possessed his body and has now given him the privilege to take his revenge. Is that to say that we are all doomed? <sighs> Great one. Is there nothing we can do to handle the situation? Like to appease the angry spirits? Is there nothing we can do? My prince, absolutely nothing. Because the gods are silent. Yeah. So you actually know something about my sister's disappearance all this while? And you kept the secret to yourself, he went. He went. Hey! There is nothing I can say except to say that I'm sorry. To go on an accident, I'm sorry. Killed your sister that went magically missing 28 years ago. That was what he confessed today at the palace. If not for the SM, I'm sure he would have taken that secret to his grave. He's a murderer and he should pay for it. That is the problem. Who is going to make him answer for it? I mean, who is going to punish him? He is the Igwe, he has the power and he has the money. So there's nothing I can do to him. Father, I'm not trying to see that I understand his humanity. I need that for us. It's your sister's daughter, according to him. And it's not going to stop at that until the entire kingdom is wiped away. May the gods forbid. It is Igwe and his household that should be wiped away. That is true. I mean, why does everyone have to be forbidden? Why? Say, as in Ufwa Kalota Manu Ozuoro, the Igwe represents this kingdom in the spiritual realm. So whenever the goddess comes to visit Igwe for his atrocity, the whole kingdom is affected. Uh, you say it is a cause him. Cannot do anything to stop her. Absolutely nothing. There's something has to be done. Something has to be done. You vicious son of man! You think you can do anything because of the little power bestowed on you? Well, I told you to enjoy it while it lasted. But now the end has come because I am going to destroy you! What makes you think you can destroy me? By the way, why do you take delight in destroying things alone? That's not the picture of the princess, no? How dare you? How dare you talk back at me? How dare you? What? I'm 
just just not tell me it's the same nightmare. This one is much worse. I made a mistake sometime. I always knew it would come upon me someday, but I never knew it would affect my people. And we all make mistakes, but you are everybody. It's true for us now. There's no mistake without solution. You see, there are mistakes you make and haunt you both your life. I committed a crime. And because of that, the princess of Nida River has me under her control. She exacts influence over me. I am totally weak. I sincerely hope that when she decides to exact her revenge, it will not affect my people. I alone committed the crime. Divorce is time for us. Bring me my calling out for my body light mission. is getting out of hand and we need to do something as quickly as possible it should be everyone knows now every one of us knows that we must do something eh? but the question is what do we do what do we do we all heard the esemodi only i and in the mouthpiece of our gods when he said that there is nothing we can do them uh, which them we are no longer talking about the monster that have taken over the Ada forest. We can as well abandon the Ada forest for them. I think our concern now should be how to get rid of Ida Miri Python that is blocking the road that connects us with other villages. And not just blocking the road, it has already devoured two of our men area before taking that position. You see that? It cannot remain like that. We have to do something and get it out of that way. Your Majesty, there is fire on the mountain. What is it? SMY Mele has taken another tour and has devoured two of our men this morning. Well, that is what we are talking before you walked in. Oh, so you people have heard? Mm, yeah. So, what solution have you people come up with? What other solution do you want? Can you force each other? If I'm an AKJ, you may Police, we are at war right now. Only one level, only one of my other tier, only one lap, but no, that's the one. Your You must have heard of recent developments. The situation calls for sacrifice. A sacrifice must be made. You can undo it. Mm. 
Fight with her. We don't have a chance. Uh, now you recommend that we engage her in a fight. You will. We don't need to think about winning the battle. We just have to fight. If we want no source, we see some of our eyes. We are going to win. Hmm. Can I call the ring? Oh, no. Let us fight. Okay. We shall just fight. But as you have recommended, as a more wind, we will just fight. Um, we will just fight. Mom, things are getting scarier here. I can't leave. I am stuck here. A certain strange python is standing on the road that leads out of the village. I mean, you don't get it. I can't leave. I'm scared to make a move. No, 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 mommy, please. I can't talk to daddy. I'm scared of him. Please talk to him. Yes? Okay, mommy, please. Please do. I, I, I will. Please. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you so much.
She promised to do something. She also promised to get me down to the sun. Sweetheart, I am so scared. You don't have to leave. Okay? I am here for you. You are safe. Yes. I promise you I will do everything within my power to protect you. So you don't need to worry yourself. Alright? I got very stupid. I, I should have believed in you. I'm sorry. I understand. I understand everything. Okay? I am not blaming you. I can feel what you went through in that forest. It's okay. So, what does she want me to do for her? I never sent her there. Honey, please. Susie made a mistake, yes. But you've blamed her enough. Now is the time to figure out a way to bring her daughter out of that land before something terrible happens to her. You know how much you love her. And we are never going to forgive ourselves if something bad happens to her. That's why she didn't it fit to abuse my affection for her. Please, my dear, do something to help that community. I'm begging you. Let us help the helpless. Please. As you can see, I have a very tight schedule that I cannot abandon to visit that land. Then permit me to do that. I don't mind. Yes. This one I return. I am very proud of you. My cabinet is very proud of you. At a very short notice, you volunteered to defend the dark community against this calamity. Ensure that you are not just proud sons of your fathers, but proud sons of this country. You see, we have a very proud history, and you are all part of our history. We have never lost in warfare, and this present calamity that threatens us will not defeat us, not when we have been provided as warriors of our community. You will go, you will engage this calamity head on. I am particularly happy that all of you here are bachelors. We are all married. You no longer have to go and pay for your wives. No. The moment you come back here, and introduce every one of them. They give me a wife. Yes, thank you. You are a pretty girl. Give me this one wife. Not only that.
Margaret. Head what, my son? Shh. The polos have gone to the hunt for my niece. What do you mean by that? Mama, those uh, are forest monsters. Kigwe and his uncle sent the warriors after equipping them. Oh. Oh, I'll do something on it. Nay, did you? Do oh, what? That the warriors have left me from the forest. So they said, but they have been back on a suicide mission. Oh, yeah, I got the See you later, also.
I was coming, I was surprised. I didn't see any snake on the road as you thought. As I said earlier, I got a report that it left this morning. And, um, well, it must have left the road for one of two reasons. Uh, either to go and end each warriors in the forest, or to just got to know that Her Excellency was coming with that one to rush with the last night. Oh, the warriors have left for the forest. Yeah, they have. Uh, to fight the monsters. We don't have a choice. Well, uh, I will report to my husband as soon as I get back. And we will see what we can do to help you. You will? Of course I will, my dear. Thank you so much, ma'am. You don't even know how much your assistance will mean to us. It's alright. Okay. First of all, thank your husband for the in anticipation of the assistance he's made of offer. I know how influential you are. But each time you put on that smile, you influence him. <laughs> thank you very much. Okay, honey. Oh, that would be very nice. Thank you so much. Yes. We'll be here until they arrive before we leave, yes. Of course she's coming with me. Okay. Okay, dear. You take care of yourself, okay? I love you too. Bye. Ah. <coughs> mom, mom. That was, that was that? Yes, dear. What did he say? He has promised to send some policemen, and I told him we would be here until they arrive. That's, that's very good. Um, Mom, you said we? Of course you are coming with me. Uh, I'm not coming with you. Don't tell me you're planning to remain here. Mom, I can't leave Emeka behind. He needs me most now. My mind won't be at rest if I abandon him in this village. Susie, you asked me to come and take you, and that's why I'm here. I was only calling out to Dad's attention so that he can see what can be done for this land. That's all. By the way, Mom, what about Janet's parents? How did they take the news of her death and Gracie's parents? Did Susie, you tell? Your dad asked me to return with you. 
Are you going to disobey him? Your Highness, this is the head of the rescue team my husband sent to help combat the situation. Who is taking them to the forest? I will take them there. You will what? Excuse me, after all you went through in that forest, you want to go back there? Baby, just to take them there, there's no big deal. There's big deal. Emeka, you're not going anywhere. Yes. Father. You heard your mother. You're staying back. Your Excellency, I will arrange for people to take them to the forest. It's all right. Baby, you don't need to worry yourself about me. I'll be fine. I can take care of myself. Okay? My most concern is for you to leave this village in good health. That's all I want. My mind won't be at rest knowing you are in this turbulent land. It won't be. Baby, you don't need to get yourself worked up over nothing. As you can see, the situation is being handled. I am not going to the forex again. I am staying here. You promise? I promise you. I thought that's good. This is where he's meant to accompany us to. 
So we'll go the rest. Excuse me. Are you saying that we'll go to this thick forest all alone? Yes. No backup? Definitely no backup. Now let's go. Time is against us. Let's go, let's go. something. What did you see? I don't know. But I'm sure I saw something. Cobra, shut up! I put it to you that you did not see anything. You are just imagining it. I know you're not believing Now the show must go on. Let's go.
That's rest here. Retired voluntarily before them. It's not too late. What do you think you are doing? I quit. Huh? Let him go. Where is he going? Leave him. Sir, Commander, what is the next thing? Sir, but we, but we are few in number now, sir. Thank <laughs> you. 
Everything is getting scarier. Where did those zombies come from? You don't need to ask. We are in their territory. This is an evil forest where dead people were true and buried of old. Alright? They are trying to protect their territory. And our wonderful Mbeks! See, Commander, we didn't bargain for this. We came here to fight, fight the monsters, and now we're still sorting else. I said to go back. No! Don't go back! We are not going back! We are here to kill those monsters, and we shall do that! Not going back! Commander, we have lost three of our warriors already. I wonder who's next. No retreating! No retreating! We have to protect the lives of our people. Those monsters are still out there, and we shall find them and yes. kill them! Yes. Yes. Yes, yes, Commander! Yes, 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 yes. Commander says, no going back. So, yes, we go not. Okay. Commander says that. Let's go. Wake up! Wake up!
my prince, what are you doing here? So it's you. Yes, my prince. You should be in your room. Ah, I think I saw something. Something? Yeah, a shadow. Where? Now we come here. I saw something and um, I think we've got a company. You understand? But what you do is stay here, keep watch. All right? Ah. Make sure nobody passes here. Am I understood? Okay, my prince. Okay. Don't tell me where I was sleeping. I couldn't sleep. I was thinking about you. Is that what you are? Not at all. I was awake. I was not thinking about you. How are you? I was going to you. I am not fine, baby. You should know. I just wish I was still with you. Has there been any updates? I mean, the police and the warriors. Not at all, baby. There's no new deaths. I'm afraid they may be all dead. Baby, don't say that. You don't think those men are able to defeat the monsters? Maybe they won't be hungry to treat you. I don't think so. They're just out there to trace me. All the same, I have to keep praying for them. 
And um, then you do the comeback. Yeah, that's a nice thing to say. I am praying for the land. And I know that by the special grace of God, all of this will be over. I hope so. I really, really hope so, really. Now that I've heard your voice, I think you can still me. If I must tell you something, I really, really love you for the most part of my heart. I can't wait for this to be over so you and I can get married and be together for life. I love you too. She gets me sleep now. Okay. And sweet tricks. I'll call you back in the morning. Alright? Under monster, sir. John! Now, let's get out of this place. Sir, does it mean we are going home from here? Rubbish. Let's get out of this evil forest post. Yes, sir. Let's go! Commander, where is Commander? He's not here. Obiora, where is uh, Where? Are, are you sure the, the, the monsters did not take him last night? That's not possible. So where is he? Where is he then? Hasn't boy any news of our warriors yet? Igwe, in the barns, but no singer na rala chan kuakea. 
but I found myself licking my elbow with my tongue. Ah! Igwe, no progress report yet. And I heard that we have lost three great warriors already. That's the report I got this early morning, Igwe. I sincerely hope this situation does not defeat our warriors. We're gonna pick it up, pick it up. My prince, please where you off to. What kind of nonsense question is that? Will you open that gate? I'm sorry, my prince. We have Igwe Express order not to let you go off on this compound without his permission. What sort of rubbish? I am, am I not a prisoner in my father's compound? Can you open that gate? I say open that gate. I'm sorry, my prince, but that's an order. What? What sort of rubbish? Come on, move that way. Where this way? Why did you allow the prince to leave the palace? 
Your Majesty, we are sorry. We tried to stop him, but he overpowered us and escaped. What do you mean he overpowered you? He had a gun. And where did he tell you he was going to? Where did he tell you he was going to? To the forest, Your Majesty. To the forest? And you are still here? Go and bring him back. Look, if you don't come here with the prince, I'll have your head cut up. Come and get out. So why would the uh, guards allow uh, Emeka to leave the palace without permission? For what? But Mo, you know how stubborn Emeka can be sometimes. They simply can stop him. Meaning, are these guards supposed to be guards or cowards? Just give me a break. But Emeka please. has his name. Oh, 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 please. He's not coming back any time he chooses. Oh, God. I just pray something. Oh, God, something bad. He just does anything he likes. Take this thing out of here. Please. As you can see, I'm in a very pensive mood. I hope you have brought me news to gladden my heart. Igwe, I'm sorry. I can't be very stubborn news. Aweke, akwana igwe, akweke naka. Our warriors just killed a young man, and the mother is enraged. Hmm. Hmm. I need to go over one hour. What is the implication? You go. When you put a pan in water, you see what I carry on, Lily. Hmm. What are you going to do if you go? Go. The wrath of Ezema is going to descend on us heavily. My son just left for the forest. Asa! Asa! Ha! I'm not asking no Jesus no cash on the daily bill to go off. If you shouldn't have allowed the prince to leave, it was a mistake on your side. Ha! Asa! Hmm. I'm not moving. Pull on your jeans, you go. But. Something has to be done about it. Something must be done about it.
Listen guys, I I don't understand what happened down there. Okay, I don't understand. Does it mean that the waker is gone? I thought we killed that spirit. Huh? Yes, yes we did. <laughs> and that was why that thing happened. I think it was the little goddess we killed and the mother was enraged. Listen guys, that's a good development on our own side. If we can kill one spirit out there, that means we can kill every other spirit. I thought they were invisible. Come on, be courageous. But, Commander, we are outnumbered. What do you mean by we are outnumbered? Well, we've lost a lot of brave warriors. That I agree. But that does not mean we are inferior. We are not. This should be an encouragement to us to fight harder. So that the death of our past brave warriors will not be in vain. Listen, we are into this together and we shall fight, fight and eliminate every other spirit out there. So I want you guys to be courageous, okay? Be courageous. Let us do this for our kingdom. I guess we have to rest here for a while before we proceed.
Let's rest. Dolu is tired. Dolu is tired. You have to finish this thing and go. That's what you did yesterday. We have to go. Walk. The monster attacked us and Chibuza was killed. What? Now what about my son? Your Majesty, we searched for him everywhere, but we couldn't find him. You are sure you searched everywhere for him? Yes, Your Majesty. Yes, 
and we are now in the most scary part of the forest, hey. from fry pan to fire. Hey. I doubt if we will make it out of this forest alive. Will you shut up? Fire. Shut up, let me think. I can't believe you have a woman appearance. And you're even such God's beautiful creature. Who exactly are you? I don't think that question is necessary. For you already know who I am. I believe you must have been too. Are you the daughter of the woman my father impregnated and abandoned so many years ago? With that single act of his, he has set up this generation for total extinction. As we speak now, the queen mother is in your life, taking revenge for one of her daughters who has just been murdered by your warriors. Together, we will tear down your father's kingdom. Burn down every living thing you can make to ashes and establish our own kingdom. How do you intend to do that? By the way, how did you get those kids in here? Just like I was abandoned by your beast of a father at birth, so were these kids abandoned by their different mothers. I have been taking care of them since years now. With them, my kingdom shall be established. But they're just for in there. They can't even make up a clan in the next generation. I have 26 of them down the Potosi. We will make up a village in two days. We must have to get out of here as soon as possible. Let's go. So where are we heading to? Just follow me. For me. I did. Please sit down. Yeah. Another terrible news. News? Yes, I just received a report that a very big snake is out there in the village destroying lives and property. Snake and more. Snake? How come knife? I don't know. I guess this must be what the Ezemon meant when he said that uh, the Ezemon Yidamiri will visit us for killing her daughter. I sincerely hope that this snake has not swallowed all our warriors and policemen inside that forest. I must tell you the truth, I'm scared. I'm scared. Because this situation is getting out of hand and quite honestly I don't know how to handle it. Hello, Princess. Hi. How are you? Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm very well. Thank you. Please, I've been trying to get across to my prince and his lines are uh, switched off. Please, can you put me through to him? Thank you. What? He did what? You people allowed him? From what you just told me now, 
I came to understand that this whole idea of revenge on my father was yours. Revenge is just a choice, but not an option. So why do you make such choice? Can't you forgive? I am not familiar with that word. All my heart craves now is revenge. And I will stop at nothing until I burn down every living thing in that land of yours. So why are you still keeping me alive? You ought to have killed me by now. Because I want you to live and witness the downfall of your father's kingdom. Then I will grant you the grace of being the last to die. Boss! Fair enough! My kids are hungry. I need to get them something to eat. I sincerely don't know why Prince Omega has to go to that forest. Why? I mean, why would he do... What if something bad happens to him, eh? I blame myself. I blame myself. Perhaps, just perhaps, if, if I were there with him, he wouldn't have gone there. You may be right. That guy seems to be very stubborn. Well, there's nothing you can do about it. The deed has been done. Wait a minute. Okay. I 
Then I can actually do something. Like what? I'm thinking of traveling to his village. No, you can't do that. You know that's going to kill you. And how is dad and mom going to know if you promise me you won't tell them? You know I can promise you that. Why not? I can definitely do anything for you, but not encouraging you to embark on a suicide mission. Immediately you step out of this place, I'm going to tell that. I swear. Linda! Linda, you have to... You can escape. Save that strength because you'll be needing it soon. I don't get it. Are you just a possessed human or a spirit being? Because I won't understand. You look so calm and harmless. I still find it very difficult to believe you're that, that fearful monster that's killing people out there. Did I say anything you don't like? It is time. Time for what? I will bring you updates as soon as we are done for the night. For now, enjoy your stay. In, in this Akos forest. Huh? If I had known we were embarking on this uh, suicide mission, I would have covertly written my, my will at home. Me too. Me too. I didn't even tell my family I'm, I'm embarking on a deadly mission. I didn't tell them. 
Shut up. the great warriors of Israel and Kingdom. Identify yourself! Now! Inspector Joe from the State Police Command. We have come to save the ugly situation that has befallen your land. So, Inspector, how long have you been in this forest? It's not easy. We, we've been here for a day. Actually, it was a, a voice that attracted us to this point. Did you guys scream? 
scream, we don't scream anymore. We've gone to hell in this forest. Torment. So we don't scream. Listen, we responded to the same voice. That's why we're here. That means there's a top party in this forest. We're ready to crush any of the Let's go! Come on! Come on! Prince, what happened? How did you get yourself here? Oh, I'm Indigo. The, the monster girl captured me. What? Yes. You mean this is the monster's cave? Yes, this is where the monster lives. My goodness. Then we must hurry and leave before she comes back. What of the, the babies? No, we need to go with them. No worry, I'll come back for the babies. Let's go. Thank you. Yeah. Oh my God. So what about uh, Susan?
What's the meaning of this? Susie so dropped it in her room. She went to that haunted village. Let me see. <laughs> What type of child is this? What did she go there to do again? And what if something terrible happens to her? Oh my God. I've been called the traditional law of that land this afternoon. And he told me how terrible things are there. You see? They've not even heard from the policemen I sent to them. That is the land Susie left for. I'm sick and tired of her mischief. Anyway. She is responsible to anything that happens to her in that land. Don't ever involve me. Help me out of that. Gloria. Hey, 
Father, Mika is here. Excuse me, Your Majesty. You're welcome. Where did you find the idiot? We rescued him in the forest, Your Majesty. Thank you very much. Um, Your Majesty, the palace guards have to uh, keep watch over the palace while we go into the town and see how we can save more lives because these monsters are everywhere. Yes, Your Majesty. I agree with Ortega. We just have to go. The monsters are everywhere. I believe our presence there will make a difference. Right. I agree with you entirely. You have my permission. And may the gods protect you. He said. Oh, Dad, I think I should go with them. Just mm -hmm. let me get angry with you. Uh, Prince, you just don't worry, okay? You need a rest, alright? While we go. We have to leave now, Your Majesty. Thank you. Oh, take up. Yeah. Be careful, my guy. Oh, boy. I'll be good. I met with the SMO and we had a conversation. You shouldn't have granted it. I know. We have hit them where it pains the most. And now, 
they are asking for a negotiation. I told him what it would cost him. And he said he would see me tomorrow's morning. So, let us stay mute. But, should they fail to meet up with our demands, we will strike back with full force. Let us go. Your Highness, we suffered a lot of damages last night. Not less than 100 people were destroyed by these monsters. Properties, buildings, all gone, destroyed. And the most disturbing aspect is that these vampires are not done yet. I have a feeling that they are coming back to suck more blood. Of course, they will. Ortega, I know that you met with the Ezen more yesterday. What did he tell you? Yes, Your Highness. He said he will be coming to see you this morning. Then why isn't he here yet? Ibe, Ibe, I greet you. Let's check in him. As a more, you are aware that a lot of damage has been inflicted on our people. I am sure you must have conferred with the gods. Be 
that your head and your son's head are being demanded by the gods. Eh? Let the deity go and find their own. That should be over my dead body. Eh? Let them go and find their own, no? Because that can never happen. Can never happen. Yes, mother. I agree with you. They should just go elsewhere. Not my family. Ha! Huh. But father. Father, you are the king. You are the supreme leader of this land. You should be the one deciding who to be sacrificed and not the other way around. Father, we do not accept this. No. Mother, mother, I love you. That's why I'm doing this. We have to do this for the people we love. If we don't do this, the entire kingdom, including you and my sisters, will be finished. We didn't choose to do this, but it cost it. It's a virtue to understand. Understand what you call Mecca. Huh? You and your father are so insensitive. You're just heartless. Money. Huh? You people have to kill me first, though. Don't you understand? Because they are the black. Because they are It's okay. It's alright, you see. 
I am the head of this family. I do not desire to die. For the gods have decreed, if by sacrificing ourselves, the community will be redeemed, then so be it. So be it. Is that what you are telling me, Dad? Why, why am I even talking to, to you? I knew it. I knew you were not going to listen to me. I knew you were not going to listen to me. Why am I here? Today is a remarkable day, a memorable day in the history of our family. A day we all shall remember. A day we shall always remember as a remarkable day. The bravery and heroism of our Ibe. Ibe Ahamez na Ojemba, the fifth of this kingdom. And his son, the Prince in America, Ojemba. They lay down their life to rid us of the calamities that has befallen us. There will always be remembered and appreciated. We will. Let us proceed. Hey! Down with your business, my friend! The Lord Jesus Christ is here to set this land free. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. And who are you, if I may ask? Me and the servants of the Most High God. Mm. His name is Jesus Christ. You are nothing but a stranger. You know nothing about this land. How dare you come to interfere in our affairs? Leave before you receive it all. You may be right. I don't know anything about this land, but he that sent me knows everything about this land. Who sent you? Tell me who sent you. His name is Jehovah Jireh. His name is Jehovah Mekadiski. His name is Alpha and Omega. He is the origin 
creator. He is the creator of the heaven and the earth. He is the foundation and the founder of this life. You are a liar. You are insane. Mm. No. I say none is greater than Okuku. None ever. And none is above Okuku. Okuku is powerless to the Almighty God whom we serve. Did you say that you are God in the Alpha and Omega and is more powerful than Okuku? Yes. Igwe Ojemba and the people of Iswana. From today, this land is free from every calamity. From today, you are free. And he is in me. He that is in me is greater than he that is in the world. Yes, Lord. 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 Uh, you said that the God you serve mandated you specifically to come and liberate us from the shackles of Satan. Uh, Satan is not a problem. It says in one, it don't really. For a long time now, we've been groaning under her tyranny, liberating us from her, the part of your mandate. What are they doing in there? I don't like the way the whole things are going on. I remember. If it's the one descend on us, <laughs> we are doomed. By the way, who caught that pastor? Who caught him to this land? My elders, let him come out and face the consequences of his action. Yes. Yeah. Pastor or no pastor, he must face the music. Yes. Look, take it easy. Let's just take it easy. Take it easy. Let me read you a passage from the Bible. Second Chronicles 7 verse 14. If my people, which are called by my name, shall humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways, then will I hear from heaven and they will forgive their sin and will heal their land. Can you explain that to us? It simply means that if you surrender yourself to Jesus Christ and obey Him as your only Lord and Savior, He will set you free from every problem. Well, you have heard him. What do you say? No, 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 no. Hmm? It sounds progressive. My entire household has decided unanimously to accept your God as our Lord and Master. So lead us to him. Um, Igwe, before that, I would like somebody to lead me where the Ezemai and her demon lives. All right. Emeka, I think this is your domain. You know the route to that place. So I will see you people off. And then you take him to the place.
why are you disturbing my rest? And why has the sacrifice not been offered by now? As a one, I came to bring to your notice that they are not ready with the sacrifice. As a one, they have submitted to a strange power. A strange man came from nowhere and started talking about a God. I don't know what he's talking about. I just don't know what he's talking about. I, then I would destroy them all. I would destroy them.
Hallelujah. She is your sister. Take her home. What about the kids you told me about? Yeah, in here. In here? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Jesus Christ. Oh, boy, let's see the card in it. He gave me no bar. He gave me no bar. He gave me no bar. Oh, boy, let's see the card in it. He gave me no bar. He gave me no bar. He gave me no bar. Thank you, Baba Father. Oh, boy, Jesus. Every